jump at the chance to actually stretch this thing out even more. Good point. Here's Campbell. The shot is off. And the 76ers go the other way with it. The drive by Iverson. Clock keeps going. Three minutes into the second half now. And Fisher kicks to Jones. And that comes off the assist by Derek Fisher. Jones has got 24. Might as well just take it into his own hands and make that big lead even bigger. Here's Matumbo. And he drops it in from the low post. That's what has to happen if they're going to turn this thing around. He's got to take charge. He's got to be aggressive and really look to push here offensively. Blunt, he's checked in for Shaq. And then for Philadelphia, McCulloch's checked in for Matumbo. Jones comes in for Hill. And it's McKee in for Raja Bell. That's flat out embarrassing. <laughs> moments you love to see. Excellent defense leading to a dunk at the other end. Clark, you got to marvel at the transition game when they've got it clicking. It's really explosive. High octane for sure. Oof. And turning oh, defensive oh. pressure into offensive opportunities, that's what it's all about. He's doing his best to carry him, fellas, but he can only do so much. Things would be different for them if he was getting a little more help. Fisher against McKee. Jones from outside. And he gets it to go. Jones has got eight here in the quarter. This is some kind of performance we're seeing from him today. He has yet to miss a shot. From deep, Iverson. The Lakers with the rebound. I don't mind that shot, though. He's an excellent three-point shooter. He's just showing a lot of confidence there. I'm right with you there, Steve. I mean, let it flow when you're feeling it. He had stolen by McKee. And now the 76ers on the break. And that one's good, Iverson. Iverson's got 41. This is one well of a performance, folks, but it won't mean a thing if they aren't able to finish it off and get the win. Fisher, the pass to Campbell. And the shot is good. And the Lakers lead by 19. What a floor leader he's been at the offensive end. You know, he's done a terrific job of moving the ball around, sharing it, dispersing it, and running the show. And all you have to do is point to their turnovers this quarter. There's a reason the scoreboard looks like it does. Yeah, their confidence has really dissipated here. Warriors checked in for Los Angeles. Tigers checked in for the 76ers. Great interplay there between those two teammates. The 76ers trail by 21. Back to Iverson. The fader. And he gets the friendly spin, and that one drops. Iverson's got 43 points. But he can't do it all. I mean, he's scoring big numbers, but he's got to get some help from his teammates. Passes it to Ori. Nice concentration to hit the double clutch layup. Ori's got 16. And with the defense playing that well, the, the double clutch was the only way he was going to get that ball off. And the basket good. So far, going for more of an inside game here in the second half, and I like that. A little smash-mouth basketball, taking it inside. Five-second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. And that one's good. Fisher's got five points now in the quarter. We've got 22 seconds left to play in the third. Got a piece of it. And they go to the intentional foul. Jones dishes to McKee. The three from Iverson, and that one's good. Iverson's got 46 points. That's just run of the mill for him. A typical day at the office. He's one of the more skilled offensive players out there. Pass to Blunt. Bryant has the open, and it's in! The buzzer beater! Boy, ends the quarter with a dead eye three as the buzzer sounds. They had that set up, I think, Steve, and he timed it perfectly. It's been a passing display all night long as the State Farm assist of the game features one of 12 assists, Steve. We've seen tonight from Fisher. Lakers leading by 21. A moment now to reset the lineups. Brought to us by Gatorade, all fueled up here for the fourth quarter. So on the floor for Philadelphia. A key out there with Iverson. Then there's Hill. Then it's Jones. And it's Matumbo. And at the five, roaming the paint. Jones drives in. And he caught that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. 
I tell you, he's really carrying a lot of the load offensively, and that's almost always good news for them. Wasted no time on that one. Iverson's got 48. That is some real serious dime dropping there. Exquisite assist. Here's Jones, and it's blocked by Matumbo. The drive by Iverson, and he dunks it down. Fantastic dunk, and he decided to hang around up there for a while, Kevin. Well, maybe, you know, he didn't want to land awkwardly. I don't know. Yeah, maybe it was a safety move. Or maybe he just wanted to give the photographers a, a better angle for the shot. Here's Bryant. A huge dunk from the youthful Kobe Bryant. Wow. Boy, I tell you what, the D was way too soft right there, like Jello. You got to do better than that. Clark, he's not the kind of guy you want to get in the way of. No, exactly. He's a hard man to stop coming down the lane, but, but you've got to have good position before the play starts. This is unbelievable. What a shooting exhibition we're seeing out there today. Now the feed to O'Neal. Outside, Jones. Here's Kobe, and he gets the bucket. Bryant's got four points in the quarter. Not trying to rattle any rims or racks there. Just up and in with the finger roll. Lynch is checked in for Jones. The 76ers trail by 20. The drive by Iverson. An amazing finish with a hand right in his face. Iverson's got 55. I don't think you can say enough about the quarter he's had. Every one of his attempts has gone down. Final quarter here, and we're just over a minute and a half through it. This is to O'Neal. And it's thrown down hard with both hands. No challenge from the defense there, Clark. Could have put that one through any way he wanted. And I love the choice there, Clark. You're going hard to the hoop. So that's throw down. Yeah, that's the invisible defense leading to a very visible finish. Lakers leading by 18. Outside Bryant. He dishes it to Jones. That's in, coming off an assist from Bryant. Jones has got 31. He's been working some magic out there today, guys. This lead has been largely his making. Here's Iverson. Again, Philadelphia. The points just keep coming for him this quarter. And just at the right time, too, as they try to narrow the deficit. Here's Fisher. The top of the key jumper is on the mark. And the Lakers lead by 20. Wow, such a steady hand. He's the one responsible for getting them this late lead. Can't argue with that at all, Steve. His shooting percentage has been off the charts. Boy, the big fella's showing us a little explosiveness for a change. Well, maybe Clark is working on his dunk skills because he looked perfectly at home right there. Yeah, sometimes he can climb those, so I'm glad to see him get that one down. The drive by Iverson. And he makes it look easy, dunking it hard with one hand. You know, guys, I would call that methodical, but explosive. You know, he waits for the opportunity, and then boom, right to the rack. Here's Fisher. Again, Los Angeles. The 76ers trail by 18. Lynch passes to Hill. From D. Iverson, another three for Philadelphia. We're three. <laughs> when you're hot, you're hot. This is unbelievable. Here's Fisher. Poked away. Here's Ori, and it's sent back by Hill. And he's able to get it back. That's good. Beautiful job angling his body, shielding the big man from the ball on his way to the basket. That's really the only way to do it if you're going to take it down there among the tall trees. His finishes can be dazzling, especially Clark at his side. Well, you look at a guy who doesn't have the height of some other big-time dunkers, and it always looks better, and he certainly makes up for the lack of height with that athleticism. Yeah, he's, his leaping ability is just off the charts, guys. And Fisher kicks to Kobe. And it's sent back by Matumbo. Here's McKee. And that one goes in as he is fouled. It'll be three points if he converts at the line. Four of their last five makes came off of a high-quality shot inside. Yeah, that's textbook basketball. Just having their way down low. A minute 50 left in the fourth. Kobe attacking. Good on the shot. Kobe's got six in the quarter. 
Here's McKee. Here's Lynch, and it is flushed down with a nice jam. Pretty, pretty passing. Timely recognition as to where the open man was. Ball's not loose. The numbers in their favor. Here's Iverson. Throws down off the coast to coast drive. Terrible transition defense there. I think it would have been pointless, Steve. There was no way anybody was beating him to the basket there. Here's Jones, and they immediately answer back with the dunk at the other end. You know, how exciting is it, guys, to see him go hard to the basket like that? I love it. It's always fun to see, and it's one of the sights you can count on when he's out there, for sure. Yeah, but you've got to try to do more to slow him down. You can't play him so soft near the hoop. Shaq dishing to Bryant. Oh! oh. Here he comes, and there he goes. Look at him punish that rack. You know, the guys on the bench are going crazy right now at the side of that jam. One twelve left in the game. Here's Lynch. Another three for Philadelphia. And that assist earned him a little nod from his teammate after the basket. Lakers leading by nine. And Bryant wide open. He shoots. And that comes off the assist by Derek Fisher. That's now 32 points for Kobe Bryant. And so only one team answered the bell tonight. Not a monster blowout by any means, but still a double-digit victory for the Lakers. Clark, their inside game was what secured them the win tonight. Yeah, Kevin, they had their way in the paint. And those are all high-percentage shots. This game looks like they've got it just about wrapped up. You're exactly right. I mean, take care of the ball, work the clock. It's a wrap. Yep, nice game. From D. Iverson, another three for Philadelphia. Making a big difference from long range tonight. That was a huge shot right there. You know, they've got time to make up the points. Having that threat outside, really an advantage to stretch out this defense. Good strategy, I think. Too nice passing here by Los Angeles. And so they choose to intentionally foul. Well, how about Kobe in this one? He's got 32 points, and those four three-pointers he's hit have helped him, too. Well, they'd be in a much different position in this game if he wasn't burying those long balls. Two shots. And he does get the second one, and that makes it a seven-point lead. There's 31 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. The dish now to Matumbo. Fires it up. Sinks it. Oh, and that cuts the lead to just five. Superb assist there. He played the role of the maestro on that one. He feeds it to McKee. Iverson outside. Good. And he has brought them to within two points. That is a clutch shot if I've ever seen one. Yeah, very gutsy there. What more can you say? He got it done at the best time. And now an intentional foul. They need the ball back as soon as possible. Yeah, you can't let them pound the ball and just milk those precious seconds away. No other option here but to foul and hope for a few misses at the line. And the first of two, no good. Heartbreaker. At the line for two. And he misses the second one as well, so he is 0 for 2 that time. Not at all what he had in mind when he stepped to the line. He could have put it away there. Look out, guys. I, mean, I think there's a lot more where that came from. He gets it going like this. It is not easy to slow him down. Here's Fisher. Tries a three off the inbound. The 76 is call time here. They're down by three. Just four seconds left in the game. They're going to turn it over. They couldn't get it inbounds that time. You know, sometimes the intensity of the game can lead to brain neutral plays like that, guys. Bryant drives in, offensive rebound, and he commits the intentional foul. And he misses the first one. Boy, he wanted that one to fall. And he does get the second one. And that gives them a four-point cushion. And so it's the...